Yusuf Malumbu's second half goal gave Kilmarnock a dramatic 1-0 Ladbrokes Premiership win over Celtic at Rugby Park with the visitors counting more than the cost of three lost points. First half injuries to central defenders Didrik Boyle and Christopher Iyer disrupted the hoops, who were stifled on the artificial surface by the hard-working home side. Kilmarnock were rewarded in the 70th minute when Malumbu volleyed in a Jordan Jones cross to give Killy their first home win over the champions since 2010. And while Celtic boss Brendan Rodgers will hurt from an unexpected defeat, only his second against Scottish opposition. With the first leg of the Europa League tie against Russian sides Ian Yeats St. Petersburg at Parkhead less than two weeks away he will be concerned about a growing injury list. Minutes before the transfer window closed on Wednesday night the Northern Irishman had signed 22-year-old centre-back Jack Hendry and he made his hoops debut as part of a back three. While attacker Charlie Musonda, on loan from Chelsea, started for the first time. There were only 10 minutes gone when Rodgers had to reshuffle his defence for the first time. Belgian defender Boyota went to ground after blocking a cross from Eamon Brophy, back in the side along with veteran centre-back Gordon Greer, and limped off in some frustration to be replaced by Nier Bitten. Kilmarnock, McDonald, O'Donnell, Broadfoot, Greer, Taylor, Mackenzie, Dicker, Mullumbu, Jones, Findlay 90 plus 2, Brophy, Irwin 81, Boyd, Chibola 65, substitutes not used, Kilty, Frizzell, Simpson, Fasan scorer, Mullumbu 70 booked, Broadfoot, Greer, Mullumbu, Brophy Celtic, De Vries, Boyata, Britain 10. Iyer, Sinclair 35, Hendry, Kwasi, Edgeward 70, Nicham, Musonda, Brown, Forrest, Tierney, Dimbell substitutes not used, Gamboa. Bain, McGregor, Miller booked, Hendry, Kwasi. Brown referee, Kevin Clancy attendance. 10,702 Celtics impressive early start gave way to some struggle as the well organized. Ayrshire side closed out all avenues and when Ayr was unable to recover from a leg injury he was replaced in the 35th minute by winger Scott Sinclair. With left-back Kieran Tierney moving into central defence. Some much-needed goalmouth action then ensued. Celtic midfielder Olivia Nitram fired a 25-yard free kick onto the roof of the Killy goal before Greg Taylor drove wide. At the other end after hoops keeper Doris De Vries had spilled a Jones effort. The Dutchman then saved an angled drive by rugby park skipper Chris Boyd. Kilmarnock keeper Jamie McDonald pulled a Sinclair shot out of the air in the 54th minute as Celtic upped the tempo after the interval. The complexion of the game changed however. With 20 minutes remaining when the unmarked Malumbu was picked out by Jones and from 8 yards out guided the ball past. De Vries for his first kill eagle since arriving in November. The 31-year-old former Norwich City and West Brom player removed his shirt amid ecstatic celebrations for which he was booked by referee Kevin Clancy. Rogers threw an on on Edward for Ebwe Kwasi and Celtic stormed forward in search of the leveller but Killy should have increased their lead. Jones blasted over De Vries' bar in a breakaway before Mullumbu had a drive blocked by the parkhead keeper, 